February 17, Monday, the Memorial of the Seven Holy Founders of the Servite Order, Religious. A reading from the Holy Gospel, according to Mark. The Pharisees came forward and began to argue with Jesus, seeking from Him a sign from heaven to test Him. He sighed from the depth of His spirit and said, why does this generation seek a sign? Amen, I say to you, no sign will be given to this generation. Then he left them, got into the boat again, and went off to the other shore. The Gospel of the Lord Seeking from Him a Sign In the Bible, a sign signifies a token that guarantees the truthfulness of an utterance or the legitimacy of an action. The words of the prophets and God's servant that cannot be verified are frequently accompanied by sign authenticating the prophecies. Because miracles are effective and extraordinary, they occupy a privileged place among the divine signs, but they are not always sign pointed to God's saving action. False prophets do miracles to lead people astray. Jesus walked miracles, designated as sign of the coming of the kingdom. But these are not considered as such by the Pharisees. When they see their very eyes Jesus' mighty deeds, they conclude that these are of demonic agency and that Jesus is in league with Beelzebul, the prince of demons. That is why in the gospel, they seek a sign from heaven. They demand that Jesus demonstrate the legitimacy of his action. Jesus is thoroughly aware of the hostility and unbelief of the Pharisees, who are opposed to the revelation of God's grace in him. In their case, he absolutely refuses to demand for a sign. Do we see the sign of God's love and concern for us? Do we seek other signs from God? <music>